Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I am so excited because I am doing my first wig haul today on this channel and I decided to go with um the cheap ones. <laughs> so I went on Shine and I decided to buy a bunch of wigs. So we're going to dive into all of the wigs. I'm going to be trying them on for you guys on camera to see what it looks like on my head, the colors, everything. So I and I took the new ones that came out on the Shine website. So we'll see if they're actually good or not. So before we get into it, make sure to subscribe to my channel for a whole lot of content every single week on beauty, lifestyle and more. So let's get into these little wigs. All right, so my hair is flat as everything else. And I put everything here, which is insane. I have a lot. I have eight wigs. Oh my God, eight. And I went crazy. I went with colors because the other one that I have, the little ponytails I have, they're all like natural. And I was like, I need something that will be crazy. <laughs> I want it to be um, not so basic, basic. So um, the first thing that I bought is some wig caps because I was like I don't know if it comes with any which most of them didn't and there was one or two that came with wig caps but I was like I'm gonna need a lot if I wear a lot of wigs so I'm gonna dive into this one because I don't know how well it looks is it good is it not good okay two wig caps in one I mean oh my god they're so tight who has a tiny head like this Oh, this one I like because it's really pale. The other one that I had, um, they were a little bit darker, I would say. This one's really kind of light. Ooh, I'm bald. How do we like that with my makeup look? That's what I would look like if I was bald. Anyways, look at how many wig caps I have. I have some darker ones. I have some lighter ones. I wish it was lighter than that, but it's okay. So multiple colors. I'm gonna start with um, this one, I think. This is a black wig, which this one comes like this um, in a little plastic bag with the thing around to keep the shape. So I'm just gonna take it out, and show you guys what it looks like. So this one is a long wig. I was like, I want, I always wanted to have, when I was a teenager, I always wanted to have long black hair because I had really black, long hair. I wanted it black, but my mom was like, no, you're not dyeing your hair. <laughs> so I never dyed my hair um, black or anything. And then I just wanted something that was going to be easy. I can put it into a ponytail, anything. This one doesn't have any clips at the front. Um, there is kind of like a thing for the scalp. So it looks more natural under. But the mesh is kind of black. And it's not clips. It's uh, elastics that you can adjust you know, you can adjust the elastics, which I never wore a wig like this before. So I'm like <sighs> struggling. Okay, so I just put it randomly just to see what it would look like on my head. So that's what the first wig looks like. Honestly, it's really cute. The only thing is I would probably have to work on the front end um, and to pluck a little bit on the side just to make it look a bit more natural because it's very very thick but the fibers are very soft it's really not that shiny to be honest so it's cute um and it's pretty long as well like look at that i like sometimes to leave a bit of my hair there so you're like oh maybe it looks a bit more natural but it looks really nice um and the prices are going to be like on the screen because i don't remember like that it's cute oh and this one i think i would take bobby pins and then put the bobby pins with the wig cap so then it would hold with my natural hair because there's no clips I love the clips when it's like this like this it holds really really well this one doesn't seem to like move too much but I would still do that what do you think should I have black wig like this all the time or no this is too much maybe this is too much this is anyways I have a bunch of other colors I'm going to show you guys so not let's not spend too much time on this one and look how easy it was to remove this like I can't believe it like for how cheap it was it's unbelievable I'm gonna stay with the long wigs for now and then we're gonna go into the short ones so this one is dark red and I had a phase where I wanted dark red too in my life so I don't need this face anymore because it is 
it has arrived and the wigs they have like a little thingy in them like that to protect them this one is a beautiful deep red color and again this one looks pretty natural as well um i don't need to remove any shine for this one i feel like it's really not that shiny so far it didn't shed whatsoever it's really nice yeah so this is the second one Ooh, so i have red for my phase of like red hair it almost makes me want to go dye my hair red, but now I don't have to because I have this wig and it's long as well. Like it's really long. It's pretty. I was like, I don't, I want some long ones. I want some short ones. I want to feel myself and be like, ooh, ooh, ooh. And again, these ones are really inexpensive. So I like, it doesn't bother me. Like I'm going to fix them. I'm going to, you know, um, I have to put the thing in the back and then I put the bobby pins, put them very like close to my hairline like this so then it's very stuck to my forehead you know um but i'm gonna have to work them in but the thing is the fibers are so fine like they're really really fine so it looks natural um this one sheds a little bit just a tiny bit but not that much you know like for sure wigs are gonna shed a little bit but this one is definitely really really nice and there's like a cut in it so it's not like the same length everywhere and again there's not that much shine on it as you can see if you don't like the shine you can put some baby powders um, and then it's gonna work good and the inside again looks like this it's like a mesh and then in the back you have the elastics to adjust it so it's not too crazy um, and I might pluck the front because the front, there's a lot of hair there. But anyways, I'll see what I do. Woo! And then the third wig that is long is this one. I wanted bright pink and bright pink. Um, This one has a little lace. It was the most expensive one of the batch that I bought. Um, 20 something dollars. There's two clips at the front, which I love these so much. Honestly, I'm so glad there's clips. There's like this front lace. So the front is a little bit more natural than the other ones um and it's pink there is like the elastics in the back to hook it that's what it looks like inside there's the elastic here and the pink is just oh, to die for i just want to show you guys so i hid the the thing but look at how cute this is this is my vibe oh my god Pink suits me so well and it's like wavy kind of. Um, it's a little bit lighter at the bottom again. The length is good. Fibers are soft. It looks really cute. And the thing is, it's not completely pink. You know, there's some white in there. There's some pink and it's like ombre. So it looks a little bit more natural and obviously it looks stunning. And I let my natural hair come through. So like it looks a little bit more natural. I feel like this is one of my faves so far just because of how it sits on the head and just how it looks overall in the mirror. But in the camera, I feel like I look weird. I don't know. Tell me down below what you think. And at the end of the video, I want you to, guys to tell me which one of the three long ones were your favorite, which one of the short ones were your favorite, and which one it overall was your favorite like the color the shape everything um anyways this one is definitely cute oh my god it makes me want to wear it all the time every single day so much better than dyeing my hair oh my god we're getting into the short ones so um which one should i start with okay i'm gonna go back into the red because we already saw red um this one is short i love short wigs they are just so comfortable um they're not in the way and this one is just like, ooh, I didn't try it on yet. So I wonder what is the length and what it looks like on me. But look at that. So this one doesn't have any clips whatsoever. There's an elastic in the back. Um, and that's it. It's a mesh and that's it. That's what you pay for. You know, like those were like very cheap, like $15 um, on there. So I don't expect that much from there but the 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 fibers are very soft the only thing is they're quite shiny so i'm gonna have to put probably some baby powders on these ones i love the length oh my god these ones are so cute what do you think about that i like the color it's just way too shiny for my liking and look 
got the little, little elastic here to really put it in the back. But other than that, I really love these. These ones were the new ones that were um, very cheap, like $15. So that's why I took them. I was like, I love the length and you know, like I can do stuff. My hair is not in the way, nothing's in the way. And I'm gonna have a bunch of colors too. So that's gonna be amazing. But um, the shininess is a bit much. So dry shampoo or other stuff like this will get, take care of this. And the hairline, I say it's not that bad, but I'm still going to have to work on it. But, you know, it flows very nicely. Then a crazy color. Ah! <laughs> Green. I was like, mm, do I like this? Do I like not this? I'm like, probably for Halloween or something. I'm like, let's go put the green one. What do you guys think about the green on me? Oh my God, <laughs> I look so crazy. Oh my God. I kind of like it with um the purple, the purple eyeshadow. It's not that bad, it's just too shiny. Um, the other thing that I noticed with these ones is that they do shed quite a bit. Um, Look, like there's a couple of hair strands that are just coming out. So just be careful with these ones. Just don't brush them too much. Don't play too much with them. They're gonna like shed a bit. The fibers are really soft. It looks nice. The only downside is there's no clips and it is quite shiny, but I still like it. I still like it. It's cute. Like, what do you think? What do you think guys? I feel like I thought I was not gonna like the green, but honestly it is probably one of my favorite because it is so unexpected. Beetlejuice. <laughs> and again, there's like this little patch here um to do like a kind of like a hairline you know so that's what cheap wigs look like um i just wanted to try cheap wigs buy a couple to see uh between like the more expensive one versus the cheap ones all right less crazy we've got some orange <laughs> it's more like redhead type of thing and this color is just so pretty when i saw the color in real life i was like oh my god i'm gonna like this so much and this one for some reason there's like a little clip there <laughs> there's this with it and there's clips at the front which it is absolutely perfect for fall i feel like this color is gonna be my go-to for fall i saw someone at work the other day um that came in and she had this hair this color and i was like oh my god i wish and then i received the ways and i'm like oh my god it's in my hands it's there it's up in within my reach i'm gonna be able to have this hair just go to work and like the next day i just can have a messy bun and just you know do whatever i want with it yeah so this one has clips in it i wish all of them had this clip oh my god this color is so pretty what do you guys think about this color I feel like this is one of the nicest one that we've tried so far within the same collection. This one, you know, like you could switch the color. Um, this was within the same collection. It's just, this one seems higher quality. I don't know. It's maybe because they were like, mm. anyways, what do you think about this color? I think it's my favorite of this short so far. I love it. It has still the thing inside again. This one is like brown. There's clips at the front which is amazing. I love having clips so I don't have to put bobby pins at the front because I do want to like keep it very secure when I wear a wig. Um, I don't want it to move all day long. And don't worry, I don't sweat with wigs. Um, these are just so amazing. And then we have another color, which I was like, I need this in my life. This baby blue is just so cute and it's gonna fit so well with you know, my, my skin tone, my makeup looks, everything. And I'm like, oof, this one is shedding a bit already. I'm gonna have to do a whole cleanup of like shedding. This one is also higher quality, as you can see. Um, there's the clips at the front, it's beige inside, and there's the little thingy there. I don't know why they're different. They were in the same batch. And this one feels a little bit more sturdy too, and heavy. Obviously it's gonna be tight on my head, but um, this one's so pretty. Oh my God, I like this color so much. What do you guys think? I didn't brush it anything. I'm just brushing it with my head, with my hair, with my hands real quick. But what do you think with this with my makeup look? I think it's just really pretty. It suits really, really well. Um, obviously the only thing I find weird with these wigs is that it's very thick here 
like it's very very thick if I put it really tight then it would be tight on my head but I would have to like maybe pluck it a bit remove a bit of the hair and it will look a bit more natural of course now I didn't like tie it all the way but yeah like look it's already like cut it's not too nice it's like a bob and I wanted like a bob cut so much and now I have it in different colors and now I have one last wig that we will be checking out and I wanted to have hair almost like this when I went to dye my hair bleach my hair for the first time which um the person messed up and they did not do what I wanted <laughs> I ended up with roots way darker than what I had um but that's another story <laughs> so oh my god this one is so pretty um there's no clips at the front for this one though and this one a whole bunch came out so many hairs came out of this one. Oh my god, it's insane. But anyways, that's the white one. Um, and I'm so excited to try this on. I always wanted to see myself with like blonde type of hair. This one is really comfortable though. And that is the last wig. Ooh, and then we have multiple like millions of wig caps here. We have one here. We have like four over there. We have a different one there. Um, but that's all the wigs that I have for today. So um, that cost me a total of $160 Canadian. Shipping included everything. So that was amazing. That was my first wig haul. I wanted to try cheap ones to see, um, you know, what I would do with it, how I would store them, like, you know, test them out, plug them, do a bunch of random stuff to check out if, you know, I don't want to do this on an expensive wig, you know what I mean? <laughs> so the cheaper the better for starters. But uh, yeah, white one is definitely one of my faves. I really like it. Way too shiny again for my liking. But the fibers, they feel nice. They're tiny. They're very slim. Um, they flow well. You know, they don't look weird in any way. Yeah, and when I place them properly, they're, it's going to look better, I swear. It's going to look better. Just let me figure this thing out and it's just going to work. So anyways, that's my wig haul from Shine and my hair is blending with the background, which is <laughs> so funny. Uh, you can barely see me, but I didn't even think about that. But what do you think? I look so much tanner. I look like I have a tan because of these wet hair. I like it so much. Anyways, um, I love them so much. Um, compared to like more expensive wigs, of course, these ones are going to shed more. The front is not going to be as natural. You're going to have to work with them. Um, they're going to look more shiny. If you really want to have a nice wig, I would recommend you spending some money. But if you want to have a lot of colors and like have fun with it, of course, like these are really nice to do that for. You know, that's why I bought from Shine because I wanted to test out different wigs, different colors to see because they were not that expensive. But my favorite wig of all time of course is my the one from insert name here it's absolutely beautiful it doesn't shed that much it looks natural it doesn't look crazy um but these ones are nice too it's just a different type of a quality <laughs> as i would say so uh, anyways that's my haul for today i really hope that you enjoyed it if you liked it make sure to like the video comment down below again which one was your favorite of all of the wigs and make sure to subscribe to my channel for a whole lot of content every single week on beauty lifestyle and more so thank you so much guys for watching i really love you beauties and i will definitely see you in the next one